good afternoon, everybody, and uh, good morning to everybody in Australia. It's uh, wonderful to see everybody here. Uh, welcome to uh, Wednesday afternoon fundamentals, or if you're in Australia, Thursday morning fundamentals or Thursday morning warm ups. Uh, great to see everybody, and um, let's get into it. Let's start with uh, a little bit of buzzing. Chromatics.
Fantastic. So the idea uh, is it first thing in the morning or first thing when we're starting out with our with our routine is to focus on the breathing and the blowing, keeping everything as simple and natural as possible so that we set up a nice, easy, relaxed mechanism. Uh, repeated note pattern. Uh, so this one, we're going to start on a uh, middle C for horn. With this one, the important thing is to make sure that the air stays the same through each group of notes. So that the tongue is just cutting the airstream and that the air stays consistent. Focusing on posture as well as uh, as the breathing and blowing, making sure that your shoulders stay square with your hips. So shoulders are above your hips and in line with your with your knees, uh, so that we're nice and open in the chest area. Terrific. Uh, repeated note scales. Bye. 
And of course, this one can go up as high as you like. Uh, huffing. Uh, we're going to start on. Um <laughs> So that one, uh, the focus is on, on moving the air as flexibly as you can and using the diaphragm to, to give the uh, accents or the, or the articulation. Uh, some stamp. Oh. 
Now for our very good friend, uh, Lisa Bergman, who is the second horn in the Baltimore Symphony. Lisa's got something for us. Uh, yeah, so um, an exercise that really helps me with low horn playing is from Brophy Technical Studies. Um, honestly, I can't find the book, so I'm going to tell you it the way I do it now, as much as I remember right now. But um, I do this anytime I have something big coming up and I really need to be strong. I think it's magic. Um, I just start on middle C and it's in three, four, three quarter notes and then a dotted half note. <laughs> you crescendo as you're going down. give you the abbreviated version you do that all the way down to the C at the very bottom and then you start the whole exercise again use the exact same air but articulate <laughs> So same thing, you go all the way down to the C below, the one we were just at, 
Then you go back and you play it in eighth notes. <laughs> I'm going to go from open horn to my B flat horn. And you just keep going until you're in the basement and it it gets things responding nicely and feeling good down there cool thank you lisa that's great now we're gonna we're gonna head up from there so we're gonna go uh, two octave chromatics but we'll only do this one time <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
starting uh, pianissimo, get to fortissimo, and then back to pianissimo. Um, so we're going to play four on the way up, the fifth one is the peak, and then four on the way down. Starting on a low G. So the next one uh, we're going to do is uh, Hecht number two. So this, this is slurred the first time, articulated the second time. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Good evening, Gail. F horn. Thank you very much. I am... Arpeggios. We're going to start on uh, a low F and two octave arpeggios, uh, something like this.
And just for Gail, we will go up from F sharp because, you know, she told you guys you should do it. <laughs> Flexibilities.
Sensitivity. So uh, this is an exercise for me when I've been doing a lot of heavy playing. Uh, I want to I want to try and get more focused, particularly in the sort of middle upper register. So uh, this is sort of like a little noodly exercise, starting on the F horn uh, on A flat. <laughs>
So incorporating the huffing and our movement uh, of arpeggios, we're going to play arpeggio pattern the first time mezzo forte legato and the second time with accents from the diaphragm uh, on top of that mezzo forte line. So. And of course that goes down as low as possible. Uh, so we're going to finish with uh, one last one, the elephant, which everyone seems to like. Uh, it's good to you know get things moving. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Uh, for those of you who are interested in seeing the uh, music and money workshops that we did at the beginning of June, uh, the link is in the chat there, and you can uh, you can get hold of those. They uh, they're about an hour each, so three days worth of. Uh, of information there but uh, thank you very much everyone for coming great to see you and we hope to see you on monday morning bye rupaul <laughs> bye thanks everyone for joining nice to meet you guys mm -hmm.